And now, Nicole, we have a guest here today. You know, it can't all be about you and I, you understand. No, no, we got to share the love. we got to okay. share the love. Do you want to introduce this guest? Do you want to do that? No, go, you go ahead. Okay. I, I, okay. I'm going to ask him about the Cure Bowl. I am very curious. I was going to say, because you look like you're ready to go here. You're ready to talk I, with him. That's why I, I am. Was just, I okay. am. But go okay. ahead. Go ahead. We have Sean Baker here. Sean, thank you so much for being on the show, my friend. Thank you for having me. So, Sean, uh, Baker Soft Wash is what exactly? Uh, it is a safe alternative to pressure washing. So we are an exterior cleaning company. Um, a lot of people have their houses pressure washed throughout the year. Uh, we use a soft wash process, which is electric pumps, high volume, low pressure pumps to effectively remove the dirt and uh, debris from the house, uh, cobwebs and things like and, that. And it really is a difference. Hold that up for people that are watching on TV so they can kind of see. So it's a pressure washing system that is softer than the actual pressure washer that I'm putting on the house, and I'm, I'm literally putting holes in my vinyl siding at the bottom of the house. By, yeah, I had to stop using the pressure washer, actually, because of that. Correct, and you'll see uh, a lot of times on side of houses where people have removed the oxidation, and you'll see stripes like Zorro lines on side of people's houses because um, they get too close. Now, with this here, this is all PVC, so obviously with a pressure washer, you're running about 3,000 uh, pounds per square right. inch. You're not going to get 3,000 pounds out of this. We run, um, our pumps run anywhere from about 70 PSI to about 125. Okay, so let's back up, okay? How in the world did you get in the business of perfecting cleaning the outside of houses? Did you just wake up one day and say, you know, I think I'm going to go clean Jim's house? How did that work? Well, uh, it kind of worked out of desperation, <laughs> so to speak. So yes, Let me tell you something. Half of us in small business started out of desperation. <laughs> we needed to eat. Uh, yeah, right. so, uh, with Okay, so everybody in this area knows that Freightliner lays off. So I was out at Freightliner for a few years, um, and when they laid us off, uh, both my wife and I both got laid off within a month's time. We oh, had to that's find tough. Some, yeah, we had to find something to do. And so with the Nextdoor app, I'm in a, a large community in Mooresville, and, you know, I started to get extra work doing extra things, and we started to pressure wash some houses. So, yes, I was a pressure washer, um, but then I thought there was a better way. So I did a lot of research. Um, I did a lot of uh, information looking, and I found uh, soft wash systems out of Florida, uh, which was developed by A.C. Lockyer. Um, he came up with the whole soft washing back in 1991 when he figured out how to do roof cleaning because everybody sees those black stains on a roof. Yep. Those can actually be cleaned. You don't have to replace your roof. We can actually clean it off there and put a five-year roof warranty back on your roof. Son of a gun, I wasted money on a new roof. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Nicole, uh, Sean, loves making fun of me, you understand? She <laughs> loved happens, that moment, yeah. you understand that? <laughs> yes. So, so, Sean, out of desperation, you started this business. Um, it sounds like what my father did years ago. He, he, started, he started painting, right, to make some money, and then it just turned into this business. How far along are you in this? You know, you start yesterday, you start six months ago, a year ago. Walk me about the timing on that. I start every morning. <laughs> no. uh, we start, we've been in business for about two years now. So okay. uh, we've been in business. We get a lot of word of mouth advertising um, more than anything. Uh, we don't do a lot of advertising, um, but we do get a lot of word of mouth uh, right now. So um, it's just a matter of you clean. People can see the difference when we've been to a house um, versus some of the other alternative uses. They've you know had. what I really like about we don't know each other. We just we just met. Um, but you've got a badge with your photo on it. And I can tell that your small business is absolutely professional. You show up and I know and I can trust you because I can tell you care enough to, to make sure everybody knows I am supposed to be at your house and I'm supposed to be working for this company. That means a lot. It, it does. Too many weirdos out in the world today. And <laughs> hey, hey, stop making fun of me. <laughs> the, the issue that we have, I'm a father, okay? I have two daughters and a son. I don't want weirdos coming to my house, taking pictures or anything of my kids. So we go with Ask the Seal. Ask the Seal does um, all of our criminal background checks and all of our employees. They provide a, a, a badge for everybody. And then when we confirm the appointment with the person, they actually get a email of the technician that coming to their house with a picture so they know they've been criminally background checked they know we have our insurances i up love to date. that 
everything we have set ourselves way above beyond everybody else and that's why we are the premier exterior cleaning company in lake norman amen yeah. and i think this company also has a heart will you tell us about the cure bowl what he's getting a call that? right now yeah. that's right <laughs> look, look at the good work we're doing uh, yes, we sir. are building this guy's business uh, absolutely, as we speak absolutely. okay so uh, his company also has a heart so tell us about the cure bowl and how you guys are involved in that okay so the cure bowl is um uh, they do breast cancer research. They sponsor Breast Cancer Research Foundation, okay? So um, they put on a, a football game in December uh, once a year, and 100% of them proceeds go to uh, the Breast Cancer Research Foundation, where they use about 90% of that money is actually done in research, where some other companies don't use as much. Um, so we give $2,000 back to the Cure Bowl. Um, each of the in-network companies that we, with the software systems, we have an in-network. We're not a, um, a franchise by any means, but we're just a, a group of like-minded individuals all using the same equipment, same soaps, all been trained the same way, all done the same certifications. So we've all decided that, hey, this is a good cause because one in three people have been affected by breast cancer, whether you've had it or you know someone that's had it. So we give $2,000. Each company pledges $2,000. So over the last few years, I think software systems and network companies have given over $100,000 back to the AutoNation Cure Bowl. That's wonderful. Let, let's take a break. When we come back, we're going to talk some more with uh, Sean Baker. He is the owner of Baker Soft Wash. you the man, Sean. you the man. Thank you, Joe. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start getting some badges around here, make sure they're allowed to be in the studio or not. Problem is, I'm not sure I qualify. <laughs> <laughs> you are listening to Local Biz Now. I am Joe Vagnon, and I'm here with Nicole Greer, the vibrant coach. And I'm also talking to Sean Baker of Baker Soft Wash. If it's Friday morning, your business matters. We'll be right back. We are back. You are listening to WSIC. I am Joe Vagnon, and I am here with Nicole Greer, owner of Vibrant Coaching. She is the vibrant coach coach and i'm also here talking with sean baker of baker soft wash before we get started sean uh nicole my phone has been texting off the hook you understand okay so i got it i got an i got another text that says you are fabulous and wonderful um but they got a question for you okay name tags what is your thought on name tags at the networking event yes you have to have one and you know my thing is is go to a company that can make you a nice badge that looks like a piece of jewelry you know that can go on your lapel that you can wear all the time you take it off when you get in the car put it in the cup holder put it back on when you're going out for something and you need to wear it on the right hand side because when you extend your right hand to shake they look up your arm there's your name tag and you got to wear it because people are looking around going oh i know his name what's his name what's his name help a guy out put the name tag on okay <laughs> help help us out we've got a lot of people to network with so i gotta go get my own professional tag professional wow yeah. i gotta get me a professional tag with some i'm put some bling on it a little bit of bling you should a little, okay. little diamond stud action <laughs> would look good go. on the handsomest man in cornelius okay, <laughs> okay sorry sean you had to hear That's all okay. that but That's I went, okay <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Nicole, you had a question for Sean? I do, I do. So, you know, we found, I've had on on the break that Sean is a good steward. And I have a core value of protecting the environment. Like, I drive a hybrid. I got all sorts of filters and things and recycling. Oh, going on you're at the that house. person. Oh, my gosh. I took a class at Lenore Rhine about the environment, and it wrecked me. Oh, I bet. I bet. <laughs> oh, my. I am so concerned. So tell us what you do to protect the environment. I think it's awesome. Well, okay. So anybody knows when you're spraying your soaps and solutions on the house, they can hurt the environment, right? So sure. we go we go beyond that. So some of the things is we limit our use of fossil fuels. Uh, yeah. So that helps with the environment. Um, we use biodegradable solutions. So after 21 days, all of our soaps are completely inert. Um, we nice. also use a plant wash um, on all of everybody's plants afterwards. So that way... Um, um, it cleans the, the plants off, it adds a healthy bacteria back to the soil, um, and it puts a, a, a buffering agent back on the leaves of the plants. So that way we're not killing anybody's plants, because plants give us oxygen, right? Absolutely. Um, we also use uh, low VOC um, uh stuff uh soaps low VOC volatile organic compound or uh yeah compounds um a lot of your soaps and stuff have volatile organic compounds in them. Our soaps do not. All right, so they're are very low. Um, the other thing is, is we either use 12-volt or solar-powered pumps. 
So we're not there using a You a are gas slaying pump. it. That's mm -hmm. awesome. And then what did you say about the amount of water that you use? Okay, so we use about a third of the water that a pressure washer does. So because the world is running out of water. We really are. So, um, right. It is no joke. It is. It, it, people don't think about it, but we really are running out of fresh water. And so every time your pressure washer's out there running water or, or soft washer's running water, you know, every time we're using water for something, it's being used, right? And you don't get it back. So that's why we are trying to be ahead of the game. Yeah. So I, I love everything that you're saying. Um, the other thing was you mentioned the roof uh, guarantee and that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Talk a little bit more about washing my roof and not having to replace it that. Okay. So we don't use a pressure washer on your roof because that could be really bad. Right. So the gliocapsica magma is a, a, spe a species of cyanobacteria that actually eats away at the limestone in your shingles. Huh. Uh, it also attacks uh, cedar shake and uh, tile, TPO roofs. So everything that we can do is is safe for all surfaces, even synth synthetic stucco for washing a house. Um, but with that uh, roof warranty, we clean that roof and then we don't have to worry about it coming back. If it comes back, you just give us a call and for five years, we'll come back out and treat it. Now, it is a, a limited warranty, so it's kind of like a, a uh, battery, so it's prorated. But at the maximum, you're only paying 50% at five years. Right. So, Joe, if you have a fungus or a bacteria, he can fix it. He can fix it. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly right. Sean, it says it right here. Fungus we'll and bacteria. Sean, he can fix Sean, it. Right Sean on his brochure. Has, has <laughs> taken what I thought was a simple thing and made it quite technical, uh, which shows he is a true professional. Thank Absolutely. You. The guy's a scientist, really. Thank you. Well, we, we owe a lot of it to uh, the people that really do the science, right? Yeah, absolutely. Sean, thank you so much, my friend, for being on the show. Really do appreciate, I appreciate it. it. Thank you. You're talking to Sean Baker, uh, Baker Softwash. If they wanted to reach you, buddy, how could they reach you? Uh, they can get us on the web at bakersoftwash.com. You can reach us at 980-435-0489. That's our office number. Um, somebody's always there from 8 to 5, or we have answering service. Thank you, my friend. And this is radio. Say that one more time. That is 980 eight zero four three five zero four eight nine or you can reach us on the web at bakersoftwash.com we are also on facebook instagram and youtube thank you my friend you are listening to local biz now if it's friday morning your business matters we'll be right back